First at noon, a Pompano Beach man is dead after trying to set off fireworks in the parking lot of his apartment complex. It happened around 10 last night in the 2900 block of Northwest 5th Street. And that's where we find CBS 4's Joan Murray. She is live this noon with more. Joan. Well, Pompano Beach dealing with not one, but two awful fireworks accidents that happened last night. One involved a 15-year-old boy who lost fingers, we understand, possibly his whole, ha his whole hand. And a man who died on this very block, Northwest 5th Street, right here in the street. Um, his family identifies him as Tavares Hamilton. So here's what we know from Fire Rescue about what happened. They say that Hamilton was setting off fireworks here right in front of his home. He apparently had placed a piece of PVC pipe into the ground and put a three inch mortar into that PVC pipe that lit the mortar. It exploded apparently before he had time to move back. It caused massive head, neck, and shoulder injuries. Devoris Hamilton did not survive. A short time ago, we talked to his devastated brother. A great guy. He was about to get married and, um, it's just tragic. I mean, you know, with the family right now, it's just unexpected, you know, that this will happen through fireworks anyway. The kids was around going to see all that too, though, because they do it for the kids. And so nobody doing good right now. Just devastating for the family. Uh, we understand that around 6 tonight, there's going to be a family gathering, uh, some type of service for Tavares Hamilton, who lost his life in this fireworks accident right here on Northwest 5th. Uh, we'll have more information coming up at 5 o'clock on the 15-year-old whose hand was injured. All that and more for now reporting in Pompano Beach at this noon. Joan Murray, CBS 4 News.